Detroit Windsor Tunnel officials are celebrating almost $8 million of improvements to the tunnel and plaza. It, it's really showcasing how we could utilize our space more efficiently. As I mentioned earlier, a lot of the other border crossings use the, use the analogy, bigger is better. We're using the analogy that more efficient is better, so we've capitalized on making the space that we have easier and more secure and faster for the traveling public, both to the U.S. and to Canada. The improvements include expanded vehicle queuing, two more customs booths, and a larger secondary inspection area. You know, with the retaining wall you know, that we moved on the, out on the plaza, the queuing space on the plaza has you know, almost you know, doubled you know, as far as the cars, you know, the capacity that we're able you know, to get you know, on the plaza at any given time. So it, it widen the capacity, the ability to be able to have the trucks and the buses to be able to make a wider swing. The new bus processing and inspection zone will take buses out of the car lineup and is expected to improve crossing times. So f folks can come in, they're in a secure environment, get processed very, very quickly, get back on the bus, and so the bus traffic will move a lot quicker and there's a lot more room and a lot better utilization of the uh, inspection lanes for our passenger car traffic. The lighting in the tunnel and plaza was also replaced with cost-efficient LED fixtures, a move that is expected to save about a million dollars over 10 years. All of the work is expected to be complete within the next six months. Melanie Borelli, Blackburn News.